Good day, guys. Bing here. Um, today, I'm going to talk about Roundup. Okay, so both in family and also in uh, Dynamo. So first, let's have a look of family. So for example, this is a, a, a model. So and there's a instance instance parameter. So we can see this handle here. But it, when you drag this model, uh, you will see it increase by every 300 instead of you know follow that handle and also you can change this so for example if i want it to uh, to increase uh, by every 100 you can just type in that okay so for example 50 and then once again so okay so um, let's do it. Okay, so first let's uh, create a, uh, sorry, create a family. So let's just uh, use generic model. Okay, so first create a reference plan, RP. Do a dimension, DI, and create an instance parameter. Let's call it L. So this parameter will be used to uh, to to have that handle so you can drag this okay now we need another reference plan so rp and create another dimension create another parameter so let's call it um, l round 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 up okay so instance as well so this this reference plan will be used to constrain the the model okay so now i'll just do a, a extrusion so i'll just draw it like like this okay so pretend this is our uh for example a join joinery okay or so now finish it and then so you will see this is this controls the length of this uh model and we just need to uh, give this parameter an, a formula link to this okay so let's go to family types and first what we need to do is uh, let's create another so this one will be used to control the uh, what do we call it in increasement <laughs> so for another every uh, 100 or every 300 so I'll just create uh, you can uh, you can just uh, make an instance parameter so we can just type in 100 for now and then go to uh, round up so this one so length round up equals uh, round up bracket um, L divide by X okay bracket times x okay so this is the formula so as you can see uh, l currently so this l equals 1474.9 and the l roundup automatically become a 1.5 okay so let's click ok and let's drag try to move this reference plane so you will see the l roundup will automatically and change uh, so following the the l okay so now let's just create a project and have a have a try of this family and load this into the project okay so now let's do a dimension okay so from here to center oh sometimes when you dimension um, it, because I'll show you why okay so let's go to family and this because this reference plan because of this one center it's 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 center left right so you can if you don't want to uh, use this as a center you can just so for example for this family uh, this is uh, the left okay so you can just choose this to left and if you want to you can just uh, oh hell not this one this one 
Okay, so you can change this to right. So now let's load this back into project. So and then it all automatically go to the center. But that's fine. We can just do an, another one. So one, two, one. So that's one point five meter. So and then you can drag this um, handle, and you will see it will increase by or reduce by one hundred every one hundred. Okay. So so you can also change this. So for number three hundred, and then. Okay, so this will uh, um, avoid having funny numbers. Okay, so that's it. So this is a full family. Um, now, let me just close this family, and let's have a look of Dynamo. Dynamo's uh, it's not. Um, it's a different situation, just uh, just but it's same similar uh, roundup. Uh, we will we, we will need a little bit of math. So go to manage, create a Dynamo. Open a Dynamo, sorry, and create a new. So first, I'm going to create a list. Okay, so um, double click. So for example, I'll just create create a list so start from maybe uh, 100 okay so finish at maybe 200 every uh, I'll just give it a very uh, random number okay so 3.345 and then oh, maybe, maybe too much 3.3 .3. okay so now let's have a look at this so we have this list start from 100 and all these kind of you know random number so what I want to do is I want to round up all these um, numbers to to 10 okay so for example this should become um, 150 this should become 150 oh sorry 160 160 160 and 170 okay okay so um, if you go to math, and um, I think it should be under here, there is these two roundup. So if you use this, so actually I tried both, um, and when you do this, it will give you, it will only round up to you know the, uh, what do we call this, to one, not to ten. So it's not uh, the the result we uh, we want. So what we can do is similar to the the previous uh, um, example, the family. So we just need to use uh, a little bit math. So here, first we just need to add a division. So divide x by y. So divide this list by so if I want to round up to 10 we can just double click and type 10 so divide by 10 so now if I show this list you will see now it will give us this number and then if I link this to this and oops sorry so now we have all these so 10, 10, 11, 11, and then we can, from this list, we just need to do a, a multi, multiply and link that to 10 again. And then we will have this. So you will see 100, 100, still 100, 110, 110, 110, 120. Okay, so if you want, so of course, if you want to, um, for example, every 20, you can just type 20 and then 100, 120, 140. Okay, and that's that's it. Um, yeah, because I'm not very familiar about uh, Dynamo, so there might be some, you know, 
easier way to do it. If you know how to do it, please let me know. Um, that's it. Just round up in Family and Dynamo. If you have any question, please let me know. I'll see you next time. Thank you. Bye.